Hello there, my YouTube friends. Okay, so today we're going to learn how to calibrate your ESCs. Okay, so I've got this uh, extremely beat up old bit of crap I've got here. Okay, and I tell you what, this thing still hammers, but might not look like much. I've broken the frame because um, this is my line of sight, bit of crap, so um, I'm always demolishing it. But anyways, uh, back to what we're doing. Uh, we're going to be plugging into Betaflight. Right, so you're going to need a battery here. Uh, just plug this bad boy into your laptop. Bam, it comes up. Okay, so you want to go over to your motor tab. Click in there. Okay, bam, we're in. You want to go down and turn on this one here so and then you want to raise this all the way to the top this is before you plug your battery in then we are up all the way to the top that tab grab your battery i'm just going to try and plug this in okay you'll hear them do their little charm song thing okay bam we want to drag this one down to the bottom so just drag to the bottom. It's doing another calibration there. Okay, so that's it. Calibration's done. That just makes all the ESCs talk to one another. Um, they know what's going on. Uh, all right, just turn off your tab. Uh, and if you want to test it again, just turn it back on. Uh, and you raise your motor tab and your motors will start spinning. So um, within that, now up here in your configuration, I think it is. Now if you find that your motors aren't spinning in the correct order, um, you may need to go back in and select one of, one of the following. Um, yeah, look, it could be anything. You could be running multi-shot. It could be on your ESCs, um, one shot, one, two, five. Um, yeah, you know, if you've got D-shot 1200, D-shot 600, you know, like it just really depends. So you want to click find the one that you need, um, then recalibrate and then start your motors up um, with your arming and see how they go. All right. Uh, hope you enjoyed that video and happy flying.